A less common example of a receptor that participates in cell signaling is the intracellular receptor. These guys, instead of being embedded in the membrane of the cell, they're actually located floating around in the cytoplasm or even all the way in the nucleus of the target cell. So they're a little bit more difficult for signaling molecules to find. Signaling molecules actually have to be able to pass across the membrane by themselves, get into the inside of the cell, and then hunt down the receptor floating around again here in the cytoplasm or maybe even in the nucleus. So this puts a restriction on what kinds of signaling molecules these intracellular receptors can actually bind to. They're only going to be binding to really small and hydrophobic signaling molecules that actually have the ability to pass through that membrane using simple diffusion totally on their own. So think any hormones that are lipid-based or steroid-based, like the thyroid hormone, for example. Um, aldosterone here is a lipid-based hormone, and it can, being that it's small and hydrophobic, it can pass across the phospholipid bilayer, it gets into the inside of the cell, it can find its receptor protein, and then once it finds the receptor protein, just like with the membrane-associated uh, receptors, it'll activate the uh, receptor. And then very typically, these um, hormone receptor complexes might actually migrate into the nucleus and function as transcription factors. Now, we haven't talked about transcription factors yet. We will by the time we get to um, discussion of gene expression later on in the semester. Uh, but transcription factors, essentially, they are components that can help to turn on the expression of specific genes. Uh, so in this example, you're having the uh, aldosterone hormone complex go into the nucleus here and activate transcription of a particular mRNA, which ultimately will lead to the production of that protein. Um, that needs to be produced in response to the aldosterone hormone getting into the inside of this cell.